Good morning, Cupcakes. It is a beautiful morning here on the Freedom Farm. I hope your day is going wonderfully. So, for today's episode, we are... Excuse me. Trying to get our pets to love us once again by throwing them around. No! Tried to pick up the dog, accidentally picked up the cat. I mean, who hasn't that happened to, right? Apparently, we're also rehashing old jokes. Anyway, um, so today for today's episode, we're going to open up the racetrack, which um, I, I don't know if you can do the day that you get your horse, but I know that you can do it the next day. And it's probably a good idea to do that because you do need to practice with your horse um, in order to have a chance at winning the race. Um, but it's fine. I'm pretty sure you don't stand a chance the first year with your horse anyway. So in addition to opening up the racetrack and getting some practice runs in, we are also going to be having the bazaar this week. I don't think we have any birthdays until Dirk's birthday, which we're going to want to get a beetle for him and wrap it up at the bazaar. And so we also got our first harvest of summer tea leaves. Oh, wow, an herb salad. Thank you, I love it. So you'll know if it's their, if it's their high quality gift, like their best gift, um, because they'll actually call it out by name. I. So now we are going to go ahead and open up the track. Hello, Ray! <laughs> Sorry, didn't mean to startle you. You know, there's a track behind these boulders. We used to have horse races there, but then the town lost interest. And when these boulders fell, it just didn't seem worth clearing them. Now that you've got a horse, I think we should have horse races again. So let's get these boulders cleared. I called in Wilbur for the job. He's a carpenter, but he's also good at clearing boulders. How is that? We'll see. Sorry I'm late, Felix. Don't worry! I just got here as well! Mm, what a mess. It's not too tough for you, is it? Ha ha ha! Piece of cake! This'll just take a minute. Uh, As near as I can tell, he blew up the boulders with his fist. <laughs> that was some good exercise. Well, my work is done here. I'm going home. Thanks! Great job, Wilbur! Now we can have races again! You can practice here anytime you want. Just ride your horse up to this arch to start practicing. Practicing is important if you want to win races. I'll be on my way. See you later, Ray. <laughs> so we are going to do practices here every day because that's how you increase your horse's training level. Only your first practice run of each day will give the maximum number of TP. If you try to practice the second time in the day, you'll only earn one TP no matter how many times you jump over the hurdles. It's the highest number of successful jumps. Before we go any further, I would just like to remind you to do all that YouTube algorithm stuff everybody's always bragging about, the like and the subscribing, all that kind of stuff. It does help me out and it does help my videos show up in your inbox more, so please don't forget to do that. Oops. It's not a hurdle. That's the starting and finish line. I think it's the the combo. 
is how many training points it increases by. Ugh. Well, almost perfect. Almost perfect. A new high score! Everyone takes care not to litter around here. You be careful too. After seeing you punch rocks into oblivion, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and listen to ya on that one. I mean, not that I was littering before. Just so, just so we're clear. Where's Marion? Oh, I think I know. Hold on. Let's get our horse. She's over in the waterfall area, right? This horse controls like a truck. So I feel I should reiterate the uh, the point about uh, trees and fertilizer is that when they're blooming, uh, you don't increase their star quality with fertilizer. What you do increase is the average number of fruits that you'll get. Um, in other words, it'll increase the chance of getting multiple harvests. So, yes, make sure to put fertilizer on them when they're blooming and you'll have three flower or three uh, uh, fruits to harvest. These radishes should be done tomorrow. The ones that I'm watering twice a day. But we're not going to want to replant them. Um, because we're hoping to pick up some pineapples and some onions at the bazaar. But I don't know. I guess we'll have to see if <laughs> Raul and Chen are actually selling them. Actually, I'm pretty sure Raul sells both onions and... Uh, pineapples. Well, he's supposed to. Pineapples are a regrowable crop, but you only get, I think, three harvests from them if you harvest them the first day, or, or if you plant them the first day of the season. But they're, the profit on pineapples is pretty nutty. And it's raining, so what we are going to do is right now we are going to grab... One of our, well, one of our less high quality rocks. We are going to hit it with a hammer. And that makes the material stone. And then we are going to head right on over. Uh, let's grab our horse, because that will make it much faster. And we are going to head right on over to uh, the manufacturing windmill and turn this uh, half-star watering can into a full-star watering can. And that way, we can water two squares at once. Nice, right? Hey there, would you like some summer tea leaves? Morning. <laughs> hey, nice. Thanks. He likes summer tea leaves! Oh my gosh, finally! He probably likes puer tea, too. I'd just like to remind you that if you are watching this within the first two hours of it going live, that means that I am currently streaming over on the streaming channel, and a link to that will be down in the description, so I would appreciate it if you would stop by and say hello. And a perfect score. Nice. How about that? You got a new high score. Welcome. Please have a seat. Oh, that's right, because I already talked to him. Oh, Ray. Hello. Hello there, Ray. Feel free to ask me any questions. Is that a fruit salad? Or tomato salad, rather? Mint tea. It'll be 680G for each mint tea. How many do you want? So we'll actually have tea. When we say we're having tea at the Zephyr Cafe. 
Nice. Mmm, delicious. Thank you, John. Wait, no, what? As you can see, in water, two spaces. If you jump, in water, three. But it really shines in cases like this, where you can just walk to the side, and now I don't have to water two rows, I can just water... Well, I'm still watering two rows, but I water them at the same time. And... Scrap metal, and... 38,400 for the lowest quality blue necklace. 44,800 for the ones that we have two of. 51,200 for the highest quality blue necklace. That's pretty good. Matcha, radishes, milk, eggs, scrap metal, blue necklaces. Hey, did someone named Lucy come by here earlier? Crying by the animal shop? Who's that? Might be at the orchard. Oh, she was crying? Honestly, what would she do without me? Well, I'll head over to the animal shop then. We're not gonna have any trouble powering up the storage. And frankly, we can probably upgrade it without any concerns. Er, butter! Yarn! Radishes! Milk! Eggs! Blue necklaces! So, uh, we've met the goal and then some. Hey, you there. Could you give me this milk? Sure. Oh, thank you. I'm actually a secret critic. Just kidding. I just like getting stuff for free. Thanks. Yes, come to my stand if you want to get stuff for free. Eater, could you tell me where the laughing stall is? Laughing stall? Go left. Thanks, one second. Ah, oh, that's better. My false teeth fell out. No one, no one could understand me. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. Greetings! I just have to help out people out wherever I go. Therefore, I insist that I help you in any way I can. Thank you. You're quite welcome. Now then, attention everyone! This stand is the finest at the bazaar! <sighs> How was that? Okay, but what if it's not the finest at the bazaar? Then you're detrimenting other people, and you're probably even detrimenting me, because people will have false expectations. I had mentioned this before, but you could- we could have saved- we could have, like, sold one blue necklace a day, or per week, and still gotten- I mean, guaranteed ourselves the top slot each of those weeks, but it's, like, the money from- the money this week, having that money this week, um, far outweighs the, the benefit of winning winning on sales. Yarn, walnuts, radishes, milk, eggs. Oh, could I have one of these ball of wool? Really? Wow, you're the nicest person I've ever met in my life. Come on. I think we're either one or two away from a reputation win. And we probably won't get it. Er, butter, walnuts, eggs, mint. Ow, ouch, ouch, ouch. Uh, are you okay? Did you say something? This is why you don't run. <laughs> I, I'm fine. I'm not gonna cry because I'm a big boy. There's a song like that, you know. Walnuts. Eggs. wonder what a walnut uh, omelet would taste like. Probably very weird. Ooh, this actually might do it. I was wondering if you could tell me where the wrapping stall is. 
down to the left. Oh, thank you for telling me. I'll come back later and buy something. Well, okay, see, here's the problem, is that I'm almost sold out of everything. So, yeah. And there we go. Sold out of everything. You sold all the items you had in display. <laughs> so far, you've earned 236,020 G. You've met the goal! That's great! Yeah, that's an understatement. That is a huge understatement. Pineapples! Yes! So, this is very expensive, but very much worth it. And, uh, thanks to those blue necklaces, we can afford it and then some. What? Oh, it's you. Are you just wandering around? You must be pretty bored. Today's bizarre. I'm looking forward to it. I mean, it's happening right now, so... Oh, hello. Welcome to my food stand. Scones. Carpaccio. And Okonomiyaki. What do we want to get? How about... Scones. I mean, we are having tea, after all. Thanks. I'll throw in the recipe for you, too. Oh, I see. We'll stop by any time you're hungry. Alright. We'll have... Nice scone. With our tea. Mmm. Delicious, thank you. Thank you, Joan, for the tea, and thank you, Claire, for the scone. Glad you came! Welcome to Ganon's Carpentry. Upgrading your storage will make your stuff last longer. It'll cost 100,000 G. Is 100,000 G okay? Thanks! I'll be done faster than you can say done! Nice to see you. Welcome to Wilbur's Workshop. Expand storage. Expanding storage allows you to store more items. I'll need 60,000 G. 60,000 G, okay? Yep. I'll have everything done by tomorrow. Ha ha ha. And we'll go ahead and pick up a couple more orichalcum. We'll keep three in stock and probably three mithril too. Mithril is used for upgrading the hoe. And actually, that's, I bought plenty from you, okay? And I believe Dirk's favorite color should be red, so we'll get some... We'll get the, uh... Bug wrapped in red for him. Chopping up that beetle. Here, Dirk, have these bits and pieces of a beetle. You like beetles, right? Oh! Banana! The 540G for each banana tree seed. How many would you like? Thank you very much. I appreciate your business. Anyway, we'll get our fortune red. Welcome, welcome. Would you like your fortune red? It's just 100 G. Abracadabra, what li fate lies in wait for you? Relaxing is nice, but try adding some excitement to your life. So, did that enlighten you at all? Feel free to come back anytime. Alright, five plays of the lucky lotto. Let's see. Oh, nice. Third place prize. Uh, well, at least it's something. Oh, nice. Another winner. Ooh, cool. Something actually worthwhile. I keep winning! I mean, it's nothing fantastic, but hey. Win's a win, you know? Third place. Oh, come on. Last week I got, I got one win and it was a branch. Um, this time we won shiratama flour, curry powder, oil, and breadcrumbs. And then we- and then... a loss. 
Come on. That's not exactly luckiest file material. Oh, and we still need to see Isaac. And get his advice. Hello there. Welcome to Isaac's Info Center. Would you like to know all kinds of inside info, Ray? Well, this is just a rumor, really. Nobody's happy when they get woken up. Animals are the same. At night, it's best to just let them sleep. If any other hot info comes along, you'll certainly hear about it. Yes, I know. You get very angry. Let's see, how much is the biggest bed? Welcome to Fantastic Furniture! I will introduce you to the perfect furniture for you. It seems there's nothing I can do for you right now. Come back later, and I'll let you know if I have something for you. Oh, that's right, you can't get the... So you need a, an even bigger bed in order to uh, have a kid, and apparently you can't... You can't get an even bigger bed until you're married. Hey, look at this. Okay. Each ticket costs 300. So all of those combined does not equal the cost of of the tickets that I purchased from the Lucky Lotta. Okay. The heat is pretty bad. Are you okay? <laughs> what? I'm fine. I was asking about you. You're always thinking about others. Don't forget to take care of yourself, too. I kind of want to say you're making it worse, but I don't know. Hey, have you seen the owner of our shop? She's up and to the right. Yeah, because he's the, the cafe. Oh, great. Thanks for the help. White breadcrumbs, shiratama flour. Yo, Ray, how are things going? Cool, let's hang out. Hey, you gotta work. We can hang out some other time. It's a fine. We'll win on reputation anyway. I just wanted to see what that response would be. Alright. So we're done again. You know, Okonomiyaki is a pretty complex dish. And so is Carpaccio, right? No, maybe not. I'm gonna try giving Lloyd some okonomiyaki. Thanks. I'll turn the recipe for you too. Oh, I see. Well, stop by anytime you're hungry. So we're gonna be able to get two pineapple harvests from these pineapples. Like, they are regrowables, but they don't it's not, they don't really regrow much, you know? Uh, if we were to have planted them the first day of summer, we would be able to get three harvests from them. But half-star pineapples sell for 2,400 each. So, yeah, you don't really get a whole lot of harvest from them, but, boy, the harvest that you do get... It's very much worth it. <laughs> I wonder what the results are going to be like. Great! Looks like everyone is here! It's time to announce the bizarre results! Our top three earners! In third place with 67,000 G! Raul! Congratulations! In second place with 87,000 G! Lloyd Store, congratulations! And in first place with 237,310 G! Ray, congratulations! <laughs> Left them all in the Dust. My goodness. Next time I'll win, so be prepared. You're the one who needs to prepare. Uh, I know that. And the person with the happiest customers was... Ray! Customers seem to like your attitude towards running a business. You 
fooled on the town proud. Keep up the good work. Hmm? You're in the top three, and you have the best reputation! Fantastic! I'm awarding you this prize for your efforts! A sushi! For gold to be the best bazaar on the continent, we are... making real progress! This is great news! I'm counting on you all to keep it up. Our gold for the next bazaar is 80,000 to 100,000 G! We can do it! Well, that's all for now. Start getting ready for the next bazaar! So we managed to uh, definitely get over 1 million total profit. And uh, we're actually, like he said, we're making real progress. We're quite a ways away. Along the way. <laughs> that cat is sleepwalking. Did you see that? It had the Z's over its head, but hey, it smelled food, so. Was there anything we needed to do here? Oh, that's right. We need to upgrade the hoe. We don't have any wool, right? Yeah, okay. yeah. I think this should be Daisy's Yellow Heart event. No. Uh, might be the other way. Yes, there. It is. Here it is. accidentally broke one of Grandpa's favorite vases. But he didn't get angry with me or scold me. In fact, he asked if I was okay and made sure that I wasn't hurt. Wait, I feel so bad about it. I know how much that vase meant to him. But he was still only worried about me. So careless. I'm so mad at myself. Don't feel down. Try harder then. Try harder. Yeah, you're right. I need to be more careful and do a better job. I can't fix that face, but I can make sure I never break another one. <laughs> I'm not gonna let this mistake stop me. You always know what to say, Ray. I don't know how to thank you. And that is Daisy's Yellow Heart event. Which is the last heart event we will see for Daisy. Oh! Already leveled up without even hitting it. Nice. Okay, now please let me grab it, thank you. Yes! And so that should be all of our chickens taken care of. Nice. All right, let's... so I think that's gonna have to be it for this episode. Uh, thank you for watching, and I hope the rest of your day is a good one. I will see you later. Bye.